It's one of the great sporting rivalries in the world. It's like the Ashes. Australia versus England. There, Coke versus Pepsi. The Cola Wars. Pie versus Sausage Roll. Why not have both? Uh, Pie and a Sausage you're Roll. You're blowing my mind. Mate. Sam, it is all about the rugby league state of Woo! origin. There's no point you and I talking origin when we can have two legends of state of origin join us. Please welcome New South Wales legend Laurie Daly and Queensland champion Trevor the Axe Gilmeister. Oh, yes. First off, gentlemen, it is an honour. Two men who've done it all in origin. You've both captained your states, you've won series, you've both been part of coaching setups. I'll start with you, Trevor. All we hear is that Origin means more to Queenslanders. Do you think that's true? And if so, why? Just something that was in kind of ingrained in India, I think. And when the late, great Arthur Beecham led Queensland out for the first time, after playing for New South Wales for so many years, I think it was uh, everyone, every Queenslander thought, well, geez, you know, uh, we finally got a, a team we can be proud of. It took New South Wales a while to understand what Origin was all about and what it meant to Queensland. For us, every time we pulled on that Blues jersey, we knew why we were playing and who we were playing for. No matter where you are in Australia, you might not be a rugby league supporter, but you know State of Origin and you always take a position. You either like Queensland or you like New South Wales. Yeah, but you also know, like, if you're going to be anywhere else in the country, you're going to be going for Queensland. Oh, I don't it's know about that. It's the way it is. <laughs> How was it playing in Queensland, Laurie? Are they, is it the cauldron that you, you hear about? Oh, yeah. It was like they were baying for your blood. It was like, I reckon, walking out into the Coliseum. The noise was um, deafening. More so too, mate, I was coming down Caxton Street. Caxton Street just got pubs and restaurants all the way to Leg Park. You'd slowly drive down. You could see... <laughs> <laughs> the passion and intensity in the Queensland supporters' eyes. That's and they'd great. be throwing cans at the bus, <laughs> they'd be rocking the bus. Oh, Adelaide, you've got a lot of pressure on you. <laughs> Get in there, buddy. Rock. As soon as the plane lands, start rocking the plane. Get in there. Origin camps. There are rumours, as rugby league fans you hear, stuff of legend. Wally used to always drive the bus. And, mate, he, he was dead set a lunatic in the bus. He can drive, <laughs> I can tell you. He used to train with the car keys of the bus in his pocket <laughs> so no one else could steal the keys so they could drive the bus. We're lucky enough to have the great Tommy Redonicus. Tommy said, well, we're not mentally strong as a team. So at the end of every training session, we had to link arms and Tommy had put four footballs in the middle and you had to kick the footballs as hard as you could, but you weren't allowed to protect yourself. <laughs> oh. and, if, and if you got hit and went down, Tommy would be standing over here going, Get up, you weak bastard. <laughs> <laughs> All right, gentlemen, one last task for you. I need you to represent your states one more time. Now, we know the first, uh, first game is in Adelaide. What I need you guys to do is appeal to the people of Adelaide to come along and support your state. Sam, being from Adelaide, he's going to sit in judgment. <laughs> yeah, basically, you have to win me over uh, as to whether I'm going to let my brethren support Queensland or support the Blues. Righto. People of Adelaide. We have opened our borders and our hearts to you already. There is a reason we don't like people from New South Wales and we won't let them in. And it's nothing to do with COVID. Go the Maroons. <laughs> well, New South Wales. Queensland. <laughs> this has got to be, be fair. fair. Okay, okay. This has got to be fair. There's a lot of Melbourne Storm players that play in this Queensland origin team. If you are going to support Queensland, my friends, you are going to be supporting your arch rivals, Ooh. the Victorians. And I know how much you hate Victorians. You hate them more than New South Welshmen. Ooh. I'm putting it to you, first origin game, the people of South Australia, get behind New South Wales and you will be on a winner. Oh! I've got to say, Laurie, that was really good. That's some bloody mind trickery right there because we hate Melburnians. Two very good arguments, Ooh. Sam. I'm, I'm going to have to go with Laurie. I'm sorry. He's, he's won it over. I'm so sorry. Oh, oh to walk out. People of South Australia, we have to go for the Blues. <laughs> well, gentlemen, thank you very much for joining us on Hot Seats. We've taken up enough of your time. Before we go, though, I do need to get you uh, to give your tip for this year's Origin Series. I think New South Wales will win 2-1. 
I'm bet the same as Laurie. I'll go 2 1 Queensland. Excellent. Thanks very much for joining us on Hot Seats, gentlemen. Thanks, Gilly. Mate, good to see you, Loz. <laughs> good to see you, brother. Well, that's all the time we've got for this episode of Hot Seats. Please join us next week when we wrap up spring and... A celebration of summer! Ring, ding, ding. Ring, ding, 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 ding. All right, that's not... Yep. Hey, leave your origin tips in the comment section below. Time for a prostate check. Oh! Mmm. Wow, well, there you have it. Get sharing, leave us your tips. We'll see you next week on Hot Seats. Did they call you Axe because of Axe deodorant? And did the Queensland side stink? (laughs) (laughs) Mate, when you're a player, there's nothing you couldn't do. But all of a sudden, I seen your coach. (laughs) Oh, Oh, I got him, got him. (laughs) 